If you guys are anything like me, your phone or device usage has probably gone a little bit bananas in the past year, year and a half. I'm not here to judge you guys at all. Personally, I know my usage for my devices has gone through the roof since we've been at home a lot more recently. I'm not proud of it. And, and to be honest, not all the time that I've spent on my phone has been all that productive, especially on some of these social media apps like TikTok, endlessly scrolling until the end of time has never been easier. Now, if you're in a situation where you're looking to possibly change that and maybe limit some of the time that you spend on your device, Apple has already embedded something in iOS going back to like 2018 and iOS 12. They put something in your phone called App Limits. Now I know that 2020 really threw app limits kind of out the window, but as we get back to a little bit more semblance of normal, if you're anything like me, you might want to be taking control and spend a little less time on Facebook. In fact, in the comments down below, let me know what app or what type of applications you want to spend a little bit less time on your devices going forward this year. For me, it's definitely Facebook. My guess for you is it's probably Facebook. Facebook is the worst. So let's take control and re-harness our focus heading into the remainder of 2021 and take a deep dive on app limits. I got this like, is that an Obama thing? Is that really presidential? Hmm, let's take a look at app limits. So first off, I'm using my iPhone 12 Pro and it's running iOS 14. But the cool thing about setting app limits is that it's tied to your iCloud account. So once we set this up on my phone, it's gonna work on my iPad, it'll work on my Mac, it'll work on all my iOS devices, which is pretty fantastic. So in other words, you can't cheat on yourself by being like, oh man, my limit of TikTok time is up on my phone. I'm just gonna switch over to my iPad and go a little bit farther. You can't do it. That is the power, power of the ecosystem. ecosystem. That's really ridiculous. So here's how to set app limits for yourself on your device. Let's go to settings. <laughs> a side note, my wife goes like all out for Halloween. And so I've got widgets on my home screen. One of the widgets that I really like is to have photos come up. And right now while I'm shooting this video, she might kill me because the, the photo here is of uh, her and my son. She was dressed as a, a crazy cat lady and my son was dressed as a cat. So uh, ignore that. Anyway, let's slide over and let's get started by diving into shortcuts on our phones. This is actually really simple to get to. Right here, all you have to do is tap on screen time and then tap on app limits. You can see I've already got a couple set here, but let's go ahead and start over with the Twitter limit. I know a lot of you need to limit your time on Twitter. I'm not judging, but I am looking at you. From there, all I have to do is tap add limit and you can actually choose all kinds of apps and categories. You could limit all of your usage with all apps and categories or all your social or all your games. But let's just dive in specifically to Twitter on this one. And I'm not trying to hate on you, Jack. It's just, you know, Twitter is something that people probably need to stay away from a little more often than they do sometimes. To get to Twitter, let's tap on the arrow next to social. And right there at the top is Twitter. We're going to tap on that and then hit next. Let's choose how much time we want to allow ourselves to spend on Twitter. Let's set that to one hour. And you can see there that it says one hour every day, or you can customize the days, which is kind of nice. If we want to customize the days, we can say, you know what, on Sunday, let's go ahead and just go unlimited and allow ourselves full time on Sunday, full time on Saturday. Like you can really get granular and control all the time that you're allowed to have during each day. But during the week, we're all business, baby. Monday through Friday, one hour on Twitter. That's what we're gonna go with. And that's all you have to do. Tap add and you've got a custom app limit set for your Twitter usage. It is that simple. So that's all I got on app limits and taking control and regaining your sanity of your digital life in 2021. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you don't, give me a thumbs down. But either way, let me know down in the comments below what you think. What apps or what types of apps can you automatically right out of the gate say like, holy crap, I really need to set some boundaries for myself right there on X. XYZ. Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.